What's up, fellow collectors? Welcome back. Today might be Master Toy Museum. I'll be a curator today. Guys, more fun, more action, man. Right here at the museum on a Saturday, guys. Uh, this is what I do on Saturdays, right? I just come down here, I got my coffee on, and, uh, Good cup of coffee, guys. Great collectible toys. You can't lose. It's just a fantastic combination. I'm sure there's a lot of good, great combinations out there, but coffee and toys, guys, you can't beat it. And not when you have more Action Man figures to add to, to, to your collection. And we have another fantastic Action Man offering for you today. This is our Action Man uh, Action Pilot. The movable Action Man with 30 points of articulation. This is probably my absolute, positively absolute favorite because I love the pilots. I love the pilots. And he's got his helmet, his pilot helmet on, and you know, you can. Bring this down, bring the visor down here. There's the mouthpiece, you know, intercom part right there. He's strapped in there, right underneath the chin there. Got the padding inside the helmet there. There's the iconic dog tags. The orange jumpsuit here, coveralls. And uh, he's got the boots on down there. I can't really see it that much. Uh, but um, beautiful figure. This is uh, from uh, Arts and Science, the company uh, based in uh, the UK. Um, they put this beautiful figure out along with uh, six other fantastic figures uh, as their latest installment of the Action Man franchise. Uh, as you can see, it's not a deluxe set. It's just a, a nice single set here. It doesn't come with uh, much, but, he, you know, he's a pilot. You know, if, if he was going to come with anything, I would love to see them make a 1-6 uh, scale. Uh, this is a 12-inch figure, so a 1-6 scale uh, helicopter. Or, or an airplane fighter jet something you know that he can sit in you know and i know if you really maybe a weapon a, a pistol or something like that a sidearm something like that but i am perfectly fine with the fact that he doesn't really come with anything to me he comes with a lot you know because it's just the helmet's beautiful his dog tags the outfit See if we can find our, the freeze force is another cool one. Let's see if we can find our action pilot. There's our action pilot here. Or he could he could have came with his parachute actually? That would have been great. Action soldier, officer cadet. Let's turn around in the back here. Get blown out look here at the back of the box. This cost me about $31 from Coswell Collectibles, but I you know I purchased the entire set of seven. Action man in pilot uniform, helmet, boots, dog tag. Pretty basic. If you want to call this a, a basic figure, I'm fine with that. Uh, I don't have a problem with that. The iconic head sculpt. I think this these figures came out fantastic. Um, 30 points of articulation for the body. 
uh, whether it's 30 or 26, you know, I don't know. I don't take my figures out. If it's close enough to 30, I'm cool with that. Uh, you know, I try to keep one thing in mind uh, that these are toys. And at these prices, and I know a lot of uh, collectors have their, their, their views on the, uh, the new Action Man figures. Um, but some of the things I've heard said, you know, they, they, they wish that um, they got a, a, a new body um, that was tooled just for Action Man. And I, I get the love for Action Man. I absolutely understand that. He, he is iconic. Uh, but a 30 points of articulation body uh, from, I believe, uh, the World Peacekeepers bodies are being used on these figures. That's good enough. If you're going to keep the price down, it's it's all about price with me. You're getting a great figure. Um, they did up up the ante, if you will. They stepped their game up. Uh, I'm talking about uh, Arts and Science, the company. They redid the bodies, or better yet, they they gave them a more improved body, as opposed to the last uh, batch of figures that came out a couple of years ago, and people really didn't like those bodies. And I can definitely understand that. Uh, but there's still something to complain about, I guess. But what you do have to understand, though, is that uh, when you start getting into um, retooling things and adding things and rebuilding stuff to for a product as iconic as Action Man and as iconic as G.I. Joe, that price... Is going to soar and you know this figure could easily have win if this figure would have gotten everything that um, collectors wanted this figure could easily be a hundred dollars you know a 12 inch action figure that's only uh, you know retailing at $31 that's not bad there's some 8 inch action figures out there that's retailing at $30 So it, it really depends on what you're looking for. Were we this picky as kids, guys? I, I don't know if we were that this picky as kids. I know I wasn't that picky as a kid, but leave your thoughts. Um, am I being too harsh on collectors that want more? Uh, leave your thoughts in the, in the comment section, guys. Let's get the, 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 uh, the conversation started about Action Man. Because I have my thoughts about that. Like I said, um, it's, this is just a beautiful figure. I, uh, I'm grateful to have uh, these figures. I'm, I'm grateful that uh, Arts and Science put, the, put another set of figures out. Like I said, because I missed out on the first two sets. So I, I was able to finally uh, catch up to these. So I said, if they, they come out with any more, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to add them to the museum collection. Your thoughts, guys, your opinions. Coswell Collectibles are still selling these. So if you want to hop over there and grab those, check out Coswell Collectibles, guys. You know the routine, guys. God bless. Stay safe. And by all means, keep collecting.